When focusing is complete, fractions should be harvested as quickly as possible to avoid diffusion of the separated proteins. Minimize movement of the focusing chamber during harvesting to avoid diffusion. Connect the vacuum tubing on the microrotifor cell to a vacuum source. Apply a vacuum to the chassis. Open the cooling block cover and remove the focusing assembly by pushing the focusing assembly towards the anode to dislodge the connector from the cathode notch in the chassis. Lift up gently on the cathode end and remove the anode end. Using forceps, remove the sealing tape from the sample loading ports. With the row of sample loading ports facing up, position the focusing assembly in the harvesting station. Two sides of the chamber are flattened to help orient and align the assembly within the harvesting station. When properly oriented and aligned, press down evenly and firmly on the electrode assembly so that all needles penetrate the sealing tape and harvesting ports simultaneously. At the same time, and using the thumbs of both hands, press the harvesting tray against the seal of the vacuum assembly. Continue to press down on the focusing chamber for several seconds to aspirate the fractions into the harvesting tray. Remove the harvesting tray. Each compartment in the tray is numbered. Transfer the fractions to microtubes or other containers with a syringe or pipette. Alternatively, seal the harvesting tray with sealing film to store the fractions in the tray. Turn off the vacuum source. 